Hi guys, today I'm doing a review on the Bumblebee, later renamed into the uh, Rhino. Pretty much the same vehicle. Main difference is in the uh, crew compartment. The Bumblebee has the uh, the, uh, the gun lock in the back right here. In, uh, in, rea in real life, this is supposed to be able to fold down, but in the model, it uh, hinders the movement of the main gun. And this one doesn't have it, so the... Uh, Main gun on the Rhino is able to move more freely. Can go, uh, can elevate this far up, and press a little bit, and move side to side. So uh, the Rhino is definitely the better of the two model. Both come with display cases. Here's a look at the back. I think it. Uh, I read that it first saw action at Kursk. It's a pretty, uh, it's a pretty good tank destroyer. The gun could pretty much uh, outrange any any other Allied vehicle, so uh, not that much armor was needed. The crew is exposed, but uh, that gives the open compartment gives it gives them better um, situational awareness. Let's compare with the uh, Marder 3 and the Hannah Mag with the uh, Pack 40. Thanks for watching.